Hey guys, welcome to the side back again, and we are all ready for the day one of Kenjam, and it's like. <laughs> about 8:15 over here and our ride is waiting downstairs so we are just you know rushing out to just grab our ride and uh, start with the event for today so i will be trying to cover everything i'm not sure how much crowd will be there so i'm not sure whether i will be able to uh, make a vlog kind of thing over there or we do i need to you know just click the shots and maybe add my uh, voice over later on so let's see you guys at the can jam then so the weather here is quite beautiful today maybe it's the early morning that's why but it is really beautiful and we are just waiting for our cab to arrive maybe it will be arriving very soon now so you know let's just head to the kenya So we are here at the Pan Pacific. It's over here, and we just got off our cab. It's like it was like a five-minute ride. So yeah, like I was saying, it was just a five-minute ride from a hotel to here. Yesterday night we even walked uh, towards our hotel, and it was just like a twenty-minute walk for us. But a lot tiring because <laughs> yesterday it was a very hard day because we need to pack all the stuff at Javen Uncle's store and. Uh, <laughs> It was just uh, we left at like 12 or maybe 12:30 from over here, and then we reached our hotel at around one. But it was really a nice ride to go <laughs> to us. Yeah. Yesterday we walked like laborers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here is the opening place, and now we are just going to enter into the place. I just shown you guys the setup last night. I'm pretty sure there may there must be a lot of people inside today because uh, everyone must be just opening up their stores and uh, they will be just over here. So we are in and everybody is setting up. As you can see, there are the same old people. There is the Sony guy. There is the everyone people. They are just setting up their entire stall. I guess they have taken half the half of the place for themselves. And here we have the Sony. I guess they will be showcasing some good stuff. Kinea is going to be here soon. And the Tangzu. I guess that is going to be Mr. Kent. Mr. Kent, are you Kent? No, she is Lisa. Okay, so he's not Mr. Kent, but we will meet him soon. And here is the Shanling. So we are setting up Shanling. Good morning. Oh, Torino. Yeah, it is nice. So, and here is the Jiban booth, and this is the owner of Fire Audio. I guess his name is Bogdan. Yeah. And he's just setting up his stuff like the Fire Audio. The entire lineup is going to be here. And well, that's about it for now. I will be showcasing and making the videos for ahead in a short while. So you know, just stay with me. So I just uh, got to listen to the Zwan who get thanks to Kent over here. Hi Kent. And besides, this is the guy who has designed these beautiful ear shells. So very beautiful ear shells, and the sound has the rich tonality value of Tangzu, which we have seen in almost all of their products, including like recently I posted a review for the Tangzu Neza, and it has that uh, crazy good sound uh, tonality because it sounded so natural. This one has more details on it, onto it, but I would I personally felt like a bass was a bit lesser than the Neza, but uh, rest everything was crazy good on it. And here is the Spirit Torino guy. Who's talking and uh, right now setting up his stuff and talking to people about the products that he crafts. And the Tangzu guys are still just you know arranging the stuff over here. Mm. Hello, Uncle. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? 
all good, all good. So here is Yumu. She from High Figo, and she's setting all the stuff up. She has brought us the Pilgrim, the Da Vinci for the Timmy's new collab, the Chop In, Relentless, and Tanjim's latest upcoming for you. And also we have this one over here, the a full Scanto 14 flagship. We will be listening to it later today. And see, everyone is now setting it up, and everything is almost set up, and we are good to go in a very short while now. I guess we will be taking just uh, another uh, half an hour or something. So now I'm going upstairs just want to check out what uh, these guys are setting it up upstairs now because yesterday night they were all busy and I might just go and show you guys the, some of the latest stuff that is, has been now set up and open now in a short while the place will be open for public so at that time it would be really hard to go and <coughs> make such videos so let's just meet everyone so first room over here wired for sound wireless audio and symphonium is going to be there along with subtonic and we have a bunch of people already here including some water cooler thread guys and it's going a bit busy over here now so you know let's just talk to some people so this is Mr. Chang, he's setting up his night jar stall over here with the singularity and some cables. And do we also have the duality over here? Sorry? Where's your duality is here? Uh, yeah, right here. Okay, so this one is going to be the duality's prototype. So, setting up everything. <laughs> and he is from Symphonium. And we met him yesterday. And here is Mr. Seth from Wired for Sound, and he's setting everything up from wires to Q style. Everything is being set up over here. It's a bit noisy over here, you know. Water cooler guys are here basically. Diesel is here, Yaps is here, Ben is here, and a lot of other people are here. Good morning. Morning, sir. How are you, sir? All good. Now, let me just go into the other room. That one was quite full with the people, and this one is Ocean 9. And this one has the Zeppelin store over here. These guys are setting up. Hey Luke, good morning. Good morning to you too. Okay, morning so far. Pretty eventful. <laughs> Meeting new people and just arranging the stuff, you know. Definitely. Yeah, we are just arranging stuff as well. Bit of a mess right now because we are setting up the video. Yeah. It's been like this since yesterday. <laughs> yeah. But good luck for today. You too, you too. Thank you. Now going into the next one, this one has the Dita, the Loto, few text tags and a lot more products. So this is Ted. Hi, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Setting everything up? We are doing a little bit of last minute setup but most of the things are prepared. Okay. Today we have quite a lot of new and interesting Oh, I things. want to try them more. This one I, I will. The Monia. So basically, yeah. um, today we have the Monia pad with the Stack X 9000 and okay. the P8000. Okay. So this is probably a, this is a really good setup for Stacks. And if we want to try the, the Monia, we have a new firmware for the other unit of the Monia. So what's so cool about this is that it is actually, it has a new wireless See, lossless transmitting dongle that you can use it with Monia and future Lockheed products. Okay, so this one has Bluetooth support now as well. It has Bluetooth support, but to use the lossless, the lossless wireless feature, you need to use the dongle. It is a protocol that they have to Okay, so th there is a protocol, a prototype, yeah. And also it's a prototype, so you can give it a shot. Honestly, I tried it. It's quite liberating to be free of wires. <laughs> Yeah, that is. A, I have been experiencing that recently with my. Since I'm more into portable as of now, so I've been using my Q style CM8 in portable, and it has made me use my DAP a little less because you know just connecting my Bluetooth and having a good time is very convenient. Yeah. Yeah. We are actually doing our roll for happiness again this year, so I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with the final tight ear tips. Okay. So final tight ear tips is a really popular ear tip. Yeah. We have some very special colors over here. 
Okay. So, what you have to do is that, of course, amongst that, you also get to win some other prizes. Okay. Sponsored by some of our partners of it. Um, we have a Kotori Dauntless from the Good Guys with Kotori Audio. Okay. Then we also have Final sponsoring the A5000 as a grand prize, as well as the Vita Audio Project. And all okay. All roles for happiness. Um, we do have some special colors, like for this color over here, this glow in the dark with green core. This is a special for Saturday, which is today. Tomorrow we'll be swapping it out for another color. So if you want to have a roll, and honestly you should because <laughs> it's a lot more affordable than okay. buying a blister pack, you should just drop by and go. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> I will be soon coming up with uh, some of my stuff to you know listen sure, to all please, the stuff. Please, please do so. Um, oh, one more thing. Um, we haven't unboxed it yet. It's the new stacks X1 and X1000. Okay. Three level electric uh, It's the first time being shown in Southeast Asia. Okay. So do drop by when it's a bit more set up. Today. Yeah, sure. Why not? I will be seeing you soon. Thank you. Thank you. Here is the data stuff. Everything, the data navigator and stacks and a lot more stuff is over here. And the next room is something really special. I yesterday have been here but when I came to make a video it was closed and the people were not here so let me just see if they are here no oh no they are not here yet but I heard the oh I met you yesterday as well right so this is the RAL room where they are going to throw the magic at you with these amplifiers the SAEQ I have been here yesterday and I was listening to this one and also with the, this one and both of these are exceptionally good exceptionally detailed but yeah this is on another level the maker is not here as of now but I guess he will be soon coming up so yeah so the maker is not over here yet for these but he will be soon coming up and uh, this is the entirety of the show that people are cu currently setting up and we are excited to be here and you know listen to a lot of stuff and meet to a lot of people i will try to make more when the place is a bit crowded but don't worry i will try to cover everything up okay so guys here is another banner on the upstairs and here we have the lime ears nema 2 and anima v2 and the elysian as well so so basically i have heard the elysian and the diva yesterday uh, the day before yesterday i was at a zeppelin store uh, but I'm kind of interested to try out the Lime Ears today. Uh, there are a bunch of products that I really want to try today. Like the Lime Ears is there and uh, we have the uh, a full Canto 14 is there. And see a lot of people have arrived here. Okay, so we have a lot of people coming in. And they are still setting up. Kenjim guys are still setting up the stuff. And some people are filling some stuff. Okay, so Raghav is here. Hey man. How have you been? Okay, so Raghav from Headphone Zone India is here and it's going to be a good event, I believe. We're going to have a good time, you know. Everything is now being set up. Yumu, done everything? I, Do you want water? I just gave the uh, one sample I gave to the uh, Kalan wants uh, you help me to take back. So I gave to your friend. Okay. One year piece, year piece of the, I think it's this one or the other one. I cannot remember which one. Okay. Same as Kobe. Yeah. Okay. Same as Kobe. Give it to your friend. Okay. Thank you. So everything is. Uh, so here is the Soranic guy. He's talking about the MEMS technology and explaining it to a friend of his. We will come back to him. Here is the. Here are the BQYZ guys. Let me just meet them. Hello. Uh, I'm friends with Ellie on uh, Facebook. And yeah, she told me that she's not coming here because yeah, yeah, she did not come. Yeah, it was nice meeting you. And here are the same audio guys from Singapore setting it up. Audio Technica is almost set up now. And we have a bunch of other people. It's going to be a good day, you know. It's going to be a good day. Let me just, you know, close the things up. And oh, I just forgot to mention, I'm here with the Ulta leather cases from Vishibhai. And he might be just back up, uh, opening some other stuff. Let me just, you know, come back soon. So I'm here at the Kinera store now and here is Jin, a good friend of mine. Morning. 
morning you are, you are very late here we are here ah. since 8 am and we were here till 1 pm last night as well oh that's crazy yeah so you're working so hard yeah yeah <laughs> okay, and you. <laughs> good morning how has been morning treating you so far yeah okay okay thank you so I guess here it is going to be the adonis for the shoot. <laughs> yeah. So it is the raw material for the new upcoming adonis to buy queen of audio. Yeah. So here is the banner for that one as well. Really cool. And we will be coming back soon, Jin. And here are the Linsoul guys setting it up for 7 hertz and the audio and a lot of more stuff they are guys are setting it up and they have the prestige ltd the v16 divinity there is the entire lineup of the audio over here and these are the people from linsoul right yeah hi. hope you guys have a good event <laughs> so tangzu is entirely set up we met kent early in the morning he helped us audition a lot of stuff and now he has his entire lineup on stage here. Where is the new one, the NV? This is the one. Oh, these two colors? Yes. The black one looks quite premium. So this is going to be the new IM which has 10mm and 8mm dynamic drivers. And this is the red one. Okay, it's in collaboration with HBB? Okay, quite nice to know that and we will be coming back soon again <laughs> and here is spirit torino we have heard the twin pulse recently i have actually owned it and these guys are setting up some of the crazy looking headphones over here the wooden headphones the unique design that the twin pulse had that i owned and he's the guy behind spirit torino i guess that's andrea, andrea. Okay. he's the designer i'm the, the ceo okay you are the ceo for spirit torino yeah. And he's the designer behind Spirit Tour, you know. So, how is everything so far at the Can Jam Singapore? It's early in the morning, I know, but you guys have been working here since early morning, I guess. I didn't know. You are, you guys are setting it up since early morning, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I yeah, hope yeah, you guys yeah, have a. Yeah, <clears throat> just getting started. Huh? Yeah, just getting started. <laughs> Okay, so we will be coming up back again at these guys again and we might be, you know, hearing some good stuff. So here is Vishibhai and Vishibhai, how are the things that you have set up as of now? <laughs> I hope you have a good one, right? Yeah, we will. Yeah. And also here is the Utopia setup with Focal. These guys have set up the entire lineup with Zeppelin, I guess. Okay, and which amplifier? Oh, Naim is it is here. Okay, so and this is AU Sounds, and Flippers is not here yet, I guess. Audio Technica is setting up his stuff, and we have this new amplifier. That one is. Could you tell us something about this one, bro? Okay, we'll come back in a short while. Okay. And here are the l -Tech guys, the guys behind the some crazy looking cables and also some black ear tips. So they might be having some crazy good cables here. They are currently setting up their stuff. And here this stuff is empty right now. Here is J11 Audio, Jomo Audio I guess. And the VX is coming soon as well. And here we have the Effect Audio lineup. I have to meet Mr. Jordan. Here is he. Hello, Mr. Jordan here already? Okay. I'm Pulkit, Gadget God from. Nice to meet you, man. Hello, hello. Hello. Good morning. Good How morning. Singapore for you so far? Very amazing. I'm here since like past two days and I'm just having the best time of my life, auditioning a lot of stuff. Fantastic. And uh, I have been to almost all the stores here since I have came uh -huh. here. From so Zeppelin, Zeppelin, Zeppelin. Zeppelin. yeah. All three of them, yeah, yeah. So I will be visiting you guys later on. Just for sure. my I'll do later. Yeah, I will. Set up stuff. Yeah. Yeah. See you later. Yeah, sure. Thank you. And here is the entire campfire audio setup, and we also have the entire AV1 setup, which if I go 
show covering up i am pretty sure that i will be spending the entire day just showcasing this stuff to you guys <laughs> so let me just go ahead and start some work now so the flip ears guys are here and here is the artha argumentum the beautiful artha in a silver shell i will be coming to listening to it later on <laughs> Oh man, I have been covered all this so far. Hello, Oliver. Hello. How are you? How are you? Good. <clears throat> so, how is the experience so far? Looks good. Can you see? A lot of people, a lot of fans. A uh, lot of things to enjoy. A lot of things to enjoy. You know, kind of. And what do you say? Amusement park. <laughs> For audio files. For audio files. Yeah, yeah. I I will be seeing you around. <clears throat> So big EVs, EYZ guys are here. Sam Audio guys are here. And Visioneers. So now Oliver is from Visioneers and he's setting it up. I guess Joe Audio guy is here, but he's not over here yet. <coughs> and here are the people already trying to, already starting to listen to stuff at Yumu. They are already listening to stuff. Oh Lillian, yeah we, I guess I chatted with you like five years ago, yeah on discord sometime yeah, five years ago I had a chat. Tim Sok guys are over here and they are doing a lot of stuff. And everything is just setting up I guess another half an hour and people will come here to start everything so we are just now waiting for them to come up. Okay so LTEC store is set up over here <coughs> and we have some crazy looking cables, some excellent looking ear tips. Barak is now available in white I guess. So these are the new launches. I will be taking some pair of Barak ear tips later on. First an exclusive look at the Elysian Pilgrim. It is going to be a 4 extraordinary hybrid design driver, one custom design line with yeah. dynamic drivers along with the Sonyon B drivers on each side. It looks quite premium from the shells. Next up we have this one, the Celeste the latest. <laughs> Relentless, the first hybrid, I guess. Okay, so first look at the Da Vinci over here as well. Quite a beautiful looking set. The wooden face cover. The face cover is again wooden. You move. Again, the face cover is wooden over here. It's wooden face cover. Yes. Okay. And like the MP2. Okay. And this is the Tanjim for you. And here is the special one, the one I have been waiting eagerly to try out the Kanto, the a full V14. Let <laughs> me just pull these out. So these little babies have 14 V8 drivers on each side. And this is again a prototype version, it is not the final tuning either. But I am excited to try it out, you know. So let's just try it out later on. Kinera has uh, set up their stall. This is the place where you can shoot pictures for the new Queen of Audio Adonis. The word and in both the colors. The Loki in two color options. And then we have uh, some of the options of Celeste. Okay, so Sajid is here. What's your, what's your day? Hi, brother. I'm shooting the video. Are you shooting a video? I'm just going to photo. Hey guys, so I'm here at the, this new brand called Eminent Ears with Travis. <clears throat> he just explained his first product to me, the Ruby. It is a tri-bridge set housing a 10mm dynamic driver with four balanced armatures and four EST drivers on each side. The best part, they have done something called a separate chamber design for each and every single driver unit onto their <coughs> earphone. And it is sounding excellent. 
and everything is sounding very well separated. The bass is coming out to be very strong and powerful, and the stage is also feeling very, very big. And so, good luck to you guys. Thank you very much. It's a huge success for you. And also it retails for, it is going to be retail at around 2000 US somewhere around that price. And it will be available around May this year. Yep. So good luck. Thank you very much. So we have star of the show over here, Mr. Raghav Somani from Headphone Zone. Hello YouTube. <laughs> hey man Timmy, I was waiting for you. Yep. We have a lot of cases over here. Yep. So I have been having a really good time uh, listening to so much good stuff like just I told you about the eminent ears, the ruby. It is quite excellent sounding. And I also just uh, got uh, some time to you know listen to the Artha, uh, Artha, the Flippiest New Artha Argumentum and also the Flippiest Aurora. So Argumentum is a step above the you know Artha. It is a bit more energetic and a bit more detailed the notes are a bit edgy but not sharp at all oh, but not harsh at all basically they're a bit sharp but nothing to you know hurt your ears or something uh, apart from that i also tried the flip ears aurora it sounds like a near field speaker setup for your ears because it is sounding so massive and such a beautiful t tone and timbre throughout the frequency band that i instantly fell in love with it uh, apart from that, I haven't got much time to try stuff, but I have tried the full Canto 14 and it is super excellent. Uh, they also tell me that it is not the final tuning, but you know, very accurate sound, I can say that. Because it has that, you know, slamming bass response, the bass is really solid and uh, uh, I won't call it overwhelming, but you know, it is uh, marking its territory that, yeah, I am bass and I, you know, I want you to feel me. <laughs> And uh, apart from that, vocals, the mid-range and the treble is sounding so open and so clear that you are going to fall in love with it. Uh, apart from that, I also tried the Elysian Audio Pilgrim, not the normal edition, the normal edition. And um, let me tell you one thing, it looks way more beautiful than the photographs. Yes, photographs are beautiful, but in reality, it is way more beautiful for me. Uh, I will be adding the uh, photo for it <laughs> around somewhere. Uh, so it is, you know, really beautiful looking. Apart from that, uh, the sound. So the bass comes up really strong and really, you know, marking its presence with a, you know, strong and powerful presence, basically. Uh, next, we have uh, the mid range is slightly lean but very detailed and tone and uh, tonally it is sounding very good. Uh, I won't call it harsh or, uh, you know, sibilant at all. It is presenting a very good sound and the treble is really nicely detailed and crisp. One thing I would like to say that the Elysian Pilgrim has a good speed throughout the frequency band. The, you know, the speed is throughout is really nice and you know fast. The transients are really fast. Uh, apart from that, I I haven't got time yet to you know try out the Da Vinci, the his audio latest collab. But Timmy's here. I have met him. He's such a sweet fellow. And apart from that, I haven't got much time to you know listen to anything so far. And it's about. Uh, one over here but you know i will be listening to more stuff and i will be updating the video with you guys <laughs> also i have been looking here and there because you know uh, i am trying to notice everyone who is over here so that's why please forgive me for not looking directly into the camera for you know while explaining or while making the video because i'm uh, noticing the people around me the audio files are really going crazy because you know every single product is here and it is something really good and a unique experience for me i have spent and i have enjoyed a lot of audio events in india and this is on a very huge scale <laughs> so i'm super excited and let me just enjoy some more <laughs> okay so i'm just at the vortex cable booth and we just auditioned this cable by them the it is the eddy 2 retailing Eddie for square. Eddie square yeah so it is retailing for 398 SGD and with the word and I have tried it recently uh, since you know that I have word and for a little while now and I have been listening to it on a regular basis with the word and I personally feel like that this cable is enhancing the stage and giving it a more open feel uh, uh, it is sounding slightly bit more detailed as well and also it is a pure copper cable and according to the manufacturers 
they say that they have designed it a pure copper cable to sound like a silver one so you know it is a good cable and i have enjoyed a good time and i have had a good time with this cable okay so this is the lavinia cable which is the current flagship in the house of vortex vortex cables and this one has uh, quite uh, you know uh, amazing setup like uh, just silver plated 5 and ofc copper with the uh, four and pure silver gold plated ofc copper and four and silver gold plated and oh no it has a lot of stuff going inside it so basically how does it sound so basically i have been using it with the word and again and i personally feel like it is super detailed nothing shouty nothing harsh at all but super detailed and nicely executing throughout the band and with the sub bass reach with this on the word and is you know really opening up and uh, just presenting with a great sound so fantastic cable in my opinion so courtesy of uh, jaben uncle over here in the can jam i got to try the much awaited turi ti and it is exceptional in every possible way it is what a single dd can achieve and you know excellently detailed and that base is coming out so beautifully i have read that uh, it has some leaner base but i don't find it to be leaner at all and it is so good and yes a bit bright yep but you know nothing to be worry about and i just loved it i just loved it a lot So I have been listening to these. The first light, and these are brand new. I am priced at seventy seven hundred dollars. The shell is a bit on the bigger side. It's a little uncomfortable, yep. But the sound, it has a grand orchestral feel, and the bass is also quite detailed. And overall signature is quite detailed, and you can actually pinpoint each and every single instrument. And the stage has a really nice three D feel to it. Well, the place is a little crowded, so I will be telling about it in a short while. But that's all about, you know. Uh, you can get about it, but a bit a fit is might get a bit uncomfortable. But apart from that, sound wise, super excellent pair, and price wise, it is super pricey as well. So, <laughs> so here is the Nightjar Duality, the upgrade to the Singularity that is coming up soon, and it is a prototype model as of now. And here is Chang from Nightjar. So basically the duality has uh, is a huge step up above the singularity i would say and it has more bass and you also get some impedance adapters with it to you know just uh, increase the bass even more if you want but i was happily enjoying it on the stock form and next up it has better details and better treble uh, it is slightly bit more exciting compared to the singularity and uh, presents a more enjoyable signature so here you guys can see here are a lot of people and let me just enjoy them <laughs> here is the zeppelin store zeppelin booth upstairs and it is full of people and people are really enjoying a lot of stuff like the headphone too over here and on that side we have all the ims from project hyla to kanpur and a lot of stuff and well that's it for the zeppelin room now i'm going on to the next room yeah. with the project tem with the these ear tapes from final audio and then we have over here a lot of things happening the lot of need is also here Hey Ken. Hi, how's life? Everything good? Everything is good right now. Here we are at the final audio show. The uh, final audio booth. We are Thanks. listening to the AI version. This probably one of the most famous audio shows. Yep. This will be the new entry level. So as you can see, there are people enjoying the and different kind of IMs, and there are multiple options available. I guess I will also be, you know, listening to some of the stuff by Kotori Audio. So this one is the Vampire, the new product. I would like to try that one out. So let me just listen to it. So here is the Blessing Two Dusk. I auditioned all thanks to Crane over here, and it sounds really good. 
very fast and quick and punchy bass response with crystal clear mid range the mid range is simply loving and emotional as said by vishal excellent song yep and details in the travel region are also quite nicely extended so critical great job man thank you, thank you. So I just met the guys behind Nostalgia Audio here and there. So these guys are behind the Nostalgia Audio, and these guys just helped me audition their latest product, the Tesseract. Uh, what is the driver configuration for this one? What? Uh, driver right. configuration. A driver. The main position will be a 10 BA and 6 EST. 10 BA and 6 EST. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. that's why these are presenting so beautiful details and so crisply detailed. Yeah. So it is very nicely detailed and has an excellent bass response. And how much is the retail cost? Uh, one, uh, the Tesla will be three six nine nine US dollar. Okay. Yeah, and this is the table for the uniform. Uniform remains. Okay. Yeah. So this is like thirty seven hundred dollars. a uh, us dollars and this cable is not included uh, they come with a stock cable this is an upgrade cable which they will be launching in may so it's a great set i really enjoyed it so i uh, mr chang is here from nightja and he helped me audition the uh, subtonic storm <coughs> at over here with the dab and it has a excellently massive staging and uh, really rumbling sub bass and crystal clear vocals so i just loved it thank you for the audition man so i'm here at the limeers booth and today i heard two ims the anima v2 which is over here i guess it is the flagship one yes it is a flagship one and this is the uh, this yeah, yeah, yeah. Like what do we call this one numa v2 numa v2 okay so this one is a numa v2 and both the ims sound quite amazing I personally feel like this one is more for my taste a bit uh, energetic a bit detailed a bit a bit more detailed actually my new details are quite clear on this one while this one is a very fun sounding set has a strong bass response and vocals are quite clear but a bit thin for my personal liking well that's all it thank you thank you so much for the audition so the first car uh, first day is absolutely over now and we had a great time i got to audition a lot of stuff and i guess i will be taking a break now because we are super tired and it's about 7 o'clock over here and we will be soon you know just going to have a rest for a short while and then grab some dinner and then come back here tomorrow morning because there are a few stuff that i want to listen to <laughs> that are left for today so i guess i will be listening to them tomorrow well that's pulkit signing off from Kenjam day 1 at Singapore 2024 stay tuned with me for future updates thank you